Yeah, the heat is on, but some storms will cool us off by this time tomorrow. Reese is in the Weather Center with more on who could see some stormy weather and when. Yes, I have all the answers, Jim. Right now, though, it is hot. It is steamy outside. I want to show you our feels like temperatures across the entire region because it really doesn't matter where you are. You're feeling the heat. The only exception is right along the Jersey Shore where a sea breeze are keeping temperatures at bay. Right now, a lot of us at the shore are in the low 80s, at least that's what it feels like, but closer to Philly, 88 is the current feeling outside, and it's only lunchtime, 91 out in Wilmington, and we also have some low 90s of feeling out there right now out in our western communities. Take a look at what's going on. We have Tropical Storm Claudette well to our south. We're going to talk about that in a moment, but I want to get you started with what's happening to our west. That's our cold front. That's going to be dropping in here as we head towards later tonight. It's going to set the stage for unsettled weather and yes we are tracking strong to severe storms and this has just been upgraded so our western communities are now under an enhanced risk to see those stronger storms that does include western areas of Lancaster County back towards Berks parts of Lehigh and Monroe counties all under category three this is the first time we're actually seeing this uh, as the severe weather season unfolds. So category three out of five, once again, our western communities where we have yellow that does include Philly under a slight risk and then closer to South Jersey, we're seeing a marginal risk. So a little bit of everything. Everyone can certainly see the strong damaging winds here. Heavy rain leading the board, but hail and isolated tornadoes are also not out of the question. So these are your potential impacts evening through tonight and we're going to go ahead and talk timing now. Take a look at 7:30. Nasty storms beginning to traverse the area, which is no surprise that uh, we have been upgraded to an enhanced risk to see those strong to severe storms. It extends from Mount Pocono back down towards Lancaster County and denoted by those brighter returns, these darker pinks here, we could even see some sizable hail out of this. Now as I move the clock forward, here's 9 p.m. Notice how it begins to break up as it crosses the coast still plain. So just outside of Philadelphia, we'll still see scattered showers, a few downpours, but we should begin to see that severe weather threat diminish as we head closer to 11. By tomorrow, Tuesday, we're not out of the woods because we're talking rain, some of it heavy, a soggy lunch hour before conditions begin to improve for us as we head towards tomorrow night. And a quick peek at Tropical Storm Claudette, who, who's had a very impressive trajectory so far. It re-intensified, supposed to pull away from our region as we head towards the next several days. So stormy starting tonight. We just showed you those impacts or potential impacts that rain continuing with us tomorrow. Notice that big cool down and then it turns fantastic Wednesday and Thursday. Sounds good. Thank you, Larissa.